Hello and welcome to step 7 of the step-by-step -step guide. In this video, we will continue binding the remaining steps in the scenario. Similar to the previous step, but this time for the second given step, right-click the given step and the second number is 70 and select Go to Definition. Use the code provided to bind the second step. Next, you need to implement the binding of the third step, the when step. Do this by adding the code provided for this. Note there are two blocks of code here that are inserted into two different spots. To bind the last step, first you have to add a namespace using for loon assertions. Do this by adding the code here. And then add the code provided to implement the last step, which is the dead step. After implementing all step definitions and cleaning up the file, you should have the following block of code. A complete copy of all the code here is in the video description, so you can cross-check your work. The next step is to build the solution and run the test again. The test should execute and fail, but this is expected. In the test detail summary pane of the test explorer, you can see that a not implemented exception has been thrown in the add method of the calculator. Click on the open additional output for this result below the stack trace to see a more detailed log of the scenario. You can see that the first two given steps executed successfully, and the when the two numbers are added step failed with an error. This is because the addition method of the calculator is not implemented yet. In the next video, we will look at fixing the calculator implementation to resolve this problem. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.